Hello, my name is Edwin Manuel Diaz, and today I want to talk about a Chinese philosopher named Lao Tzu and his work that he did today. Um, basically, I will be talking in detail about Tao, the Tao, and essentially what the Tao is, it is a way of life, a, a route, meaning what you should do, you know, the path. Many people find the meaning a little different but essentially it just means the route the way to go if you want to have a life filled with serenity a life filled with ease with clarity if you want just a life of no stress a good life essentially and here we'll be going over some of Lao Tzu's quotes the first one saying those who know do not speak those who speak do not know Essentially, what this quote is saying and how I can relate it to the real world currently is that, unfortunately, a lot of people, not everybody, but a lot of people nowadays, when they know a lot about a certain topic or what they're fighting for, they won't necessarily have, you know, they know what they're standing up for and they know to their own ability everything they, they know they are standing up for. So they know just how Lao Tzu stated how there's no such thing in the Tao as only good and only evil but both people that are ex want to express their opinion they know that what they're standing up for there could be good and bad and usually they stay silent and then for example those who speak do not know essentially a lot of the times unfortunately the way a human is is that people will fight for what they want to fight for or believe what they want to believe without knowing the whole story even their own another one of Lao Tzu's great quotes was when he mentioned when you are content to be simply yourself and don't compare or compete everyone will respect you now this one really hit hard to me and to a lot of people that I know because essentially even it, it just expresses the fact that you should never compare yourself never you should only compare yourself to yourself, to essentially your past self. You always want to be better than you were yesterday. And a lot of people in today's society, not just today, but since humanity has existed, people always compare themselves. And because people compare themselves, there also exists, as a result, jealousy. This is why Lao Tzu said this, because he knows a good, easy life is not it cannot be possible if you compare yourself to other people. He also mentioned, for instance, um, give me one second. The flame that burns twice as bright burns half as long. Now, this is another important quote. The way I took it and the way it is perceived by many people is that the flame that burns twice as bright br burns bright half as long is that if you are doing something, the way a lot of people take it, if you are trying to, for instance, one way to take it, if you're trying to show off to what you're about, to other people about what you're doing, you're really trying hard to the point where you're giving all yourself, you're gonna burn out. And if you're giving your all too much, you're gonna burn out faster. This is why you need to know how to have patience, which is key in Taoism. And you need to have humility and you need to be humble essentially because you will burn out people will burn out that's just the way humans are eventually humans burn out and this is why Lao Tzu stressed this and another great quote that Lao Tzu mentioned is that for instance where he says right here if you try to change it you will ruin it try to hold it you will lose it so essentially in this quote that he said one of the greatest quotes in my opinion that he has said is that if if you try to if you live in the moment essentially if you try to live with something that you've always lived for and i don't know where you try to change it you will ruin it because the reason why one feels a certain way when they're enjoying life an aspect of their life it's because it is what it is People, you have to live with the good and the bad. And if you try to alter the reality to any degree, 
you will essentially change it and you you won't know the outcome the outcome will be different so it is important for people to just sometimes just let things go the way they're gonna go let the wave take it and life will go on and you will keep enjoying it how it should be enjoyed how it should be by the universe from the universe and that's why Lao Tzu really mentioned this and he found it to be an extremely important way to live your life to just let things go you don't have people don't have to control everything you know one other quote that he mentioned is over here where it says the wise man who is one the wise man is one who knows what he does not know now this is probably one of the most outstanding and unique quotes that many people probably know about but don't necessarily practice because you know a lot of people want to continue achieving and which is great you know achieve, achieve with what makes you happy but people a lot of people especially young people like me for instance i know i could i'm comparing to the real world is we a lot of people believe they know it all when in reality they don't Things are not as simple as just A and B. To to achieve a certain lifestyle, to achieve a certain point in your life, and to achieve the serenity that you want, you have to realize that you do not know it all and that you just have to let the wave of life take you, but also control how you are, your emotions, your interactions with other people, learn how to be have humility, learn how to be humble and just essentially be kind to others, care about others, know that there's more to life and that you don't know it all. So thank you everybody for listening to me and thank you for, for your time. Have a great day.